Good morning, guys. We are set up and ready to go. We've got an ice hole here. I actually hunted this yesterday with a group of guys. We did pretty well, and I think I can get another good hunt out of it today. I'm here by myself, so chances are good. We'll probably be able to get six ducks in the spread, so that's what we're going to do today. I brought out one and a half dozen of the last pass honker floaters from Final Approach. I The way I got in here, so... I took all of my decoys, my duck decoys went in my sled, so I have two dozen duck decoys, put those in my sled, and I took those honker decoys and put them on the kayak. So I had to make two trips, I'm walking in, we're in, the lake is all iced up, I can't paddle the kayak, I can't get the boat in here, and I don't think the spot would be that great if it was all open water anyway. So this is kind of how I had to roll. So I took my sled, and then I went back, grabbed the kayak, put those three six slot bags with the honker decoys and then drug that out here as well. So the hide today is kind of cool because I basically turned a bush into a blind. I, uh, I thought about possibly building a blind out of all these rocks, but that would have taken a long time and I was kind of scared of getting crushed if it fell over. So here's what the blind looks like. I will be sitting on that rock right there we turn this bush into a blind. I found some grass, put it on there. Found some sticks, put it on there. And then uh, kind of did a little bit of a rock blind here. These big flat sheets of limestone work pretty good for that. So that's what she looks like. I haven't hunted out of a blind like this, I think, at all this season or last season. It's been a very long time since I've actually built a blind and hunted out of it on public ground. So. That's the gist of what we got going on today. It's a west wind right now, but it's going to switch to a north northwest wind, which is perfect for this spot. So I'm going to uh, just kind of sit down here, wait. It's 6:40. We got probably about 30 minutes or so until shooting time. So that's what we're going to do today. Hopefully, it's a good one. Out of nowhere. Nice. <laughs> Drake Shoveler. First duck of the day is a pretty nice Drake Shoveler. So nice green on the head. White on the body. I think the one I'm getting mounted is uh, actually better looking than this one. I shot it back in December. So sweet. These ducks, I've had a few work, but they just didn't want to give it up. So we'll, we'll keep at it here. I might have to do something about my hide on my left side because they get to over there and they just kind of peel out. They just kind of slide. So. I don't know, we'll see what a few more groups do and then address that if, if needed. So, <sighs> off to a good start. Right in front. There's a uh, half my limit. I was a little nervous that one out there was gonna get away, but I guess he is not. Got him on that third shell. Let's see if I can get out here. This water is deep. Oh wow, that's deep. Come on, Susie. That was awesome. I uh, I don't even remember what I was doing. I was like looking over there and all of a sudden I see these two ducks just cupping down into the set. Just perfect. So I did shoot a, a hen, but hey, that's all right. So the drake is out there floating. This water, the depth, it just drops off of this thing really quick. So that's why I bring the kayak. So I'll let that one float over. The wind will push it and uh, I'll get it with the kayak. So 
halfway to a limit. Got a Spoonie Drake, a Mallard Hen, and a Mallard Drake so far. So, not super fast action this morning. It's actually been fairly slow, but it is 7.50. So it hasn't even been an hour yet, and I've got three ducks in the bag. So, I'm a happy guy. This is good. I think the blind's working good. I've got the decoy set good. The wind is gonna be right at my back. So let's see if we can finish out a limit here before nine o'clock. That would be awesome. Mallard Drake, baby. So that makes Mallard number three. Sweet. I think we'll get a limit out today. At least I hope so. It's It's been pretty slow. I'm seeing a lot of birds flying around. So, you know, I think it's just gonna be when we get that lone single looking to mingle when we're gonna get something to come through. But yeah, missed him on that first shot. So that's fun. I I got no explanation on that one, but I pulled up and he was he was out there a lot farther than I thought he was. So we got it done. Mallard Drake. Here we go. We got a single right out front. It's coming right in. Golden eye, baby. Heck yeah. I know some people aren't too fond of these things, but I don't get to shoot them very much, so I think they're pretty cool. The action's heating up. I just shot that Mallard Drake. Sweet. just as I sat down to eat my snack. Bird number six comes into the set. <laughs> well, that last one, I was sitting in the blind here. <clears throat> There's the blind if you guys want a good look at it. Got, a, got some rocks. It, it's really not that great looking, but obviously worked today. Um, I sat down, grabbed my Pop-Tarts out of my bag, and I uh, got about two bites in, and then whew, that golden eye just sets right into the set. And I was like, well, it's now or never, haven't seen anything in an hour, so we're gonna take advantage of this opportunity. It was a golden eye hen, but uh, here's the birds, check them out. Got three mallards, a spoonie, and two golden eye. It's an interesting little bag, a little bit of variety, spices things up. I like hunting the lake because you never know what you're gonna get. Like, spoonie, I, I had no clue that I was gonna get a spoonie today. Like, Normally they're not really here in January. I don't see a whole lot of them, but especially on a lake. I feel like it's just an odd place to shoot a spoonie. But uh, yeah, the spread was one and a half dozen of the last pass honker floaters from Final Approach. And then uh, a dozen live mallards and a dozen HD mallards and two spinners. So, you know, nothing crazy over here little one man shoot but hey it was a good day so if you enjoyed this video make sure to leave me a thumbs up and if you're not subscribed hit that subscribe button and i will catch you guys on the next video